welcome to part two of our Shein Curve haul. Everything that I have for you all today is either in a 1XL or a 2XL, and of course it's going to be linked and listed down below. If you're interested in picking up any of the items, check my description box down below. And Shein was kind enough to give us a coupon code. Hotmus15 is going to save you 15% off your order over at Shein. It is not an affiliate code. It does not earn me any type of commission. Also make sure to use your Rakuten for 5% cash back again not sponsored or affiliated with Rakuten it's just a way that I love to save money and help you all save money as well I do believe my referral link will give you a $30 sign up bonus once you meet your qualified purchase of $30 or more which is really easy to do plus you'll get free shipping over at Shein and I will get $30 as well if you do use my Rakuten link if you don't want to give me 30 bucks and you don't want 30 bucks that's fine just go on over to Rakuten and sign up <laughs> It's not that serious. If you are new here, hello and welcome to the queen of sassy pants. They are now engaged. My name is Rhonda and over here we're all about embracing our curves. Body positivity, friends. We don't let the number on the scale or the tag in our britches define our happiness. And I'm telling you, once I've implemented that into my life, I feel like I've become a much happier person. Sassier sassier for sure but definitely happier because i don't let the numbers control this so if you are struggling i i ask you join me on this journey of embracing ourselves so this is part two of our Shein haul if you caught the last video uh if not it's okay i'm not mad at you we're friends here we are friends and friends aren't mean in the comments just saying. So I will try and remember to link the video down below. This was one of the items from the haul. I told you all it was the pants were too small, but the duster fit perfectly. And I did pair it with one of these, I call them bandos from Shein. I'll have everything linked and listed down below for y'all. So this haul, I'm trying to keep it a little faster than most of my Shein hauls, but don't worry because I've got um, many more Shein hauls to come. I also have some more Yvette Sports. Yes, I know. I love, I love their stuff. And I also have a uh, Savage X Fenty. So, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this pair, I think was, oh, you know what I did? I got it in a darker pair because I love these so much. So these are in a 2XL and these are the most comfortable jeans. They have a good amount of stretch, but what I love is this wide waistband with the three buttons. Now, if you caught my last video, you did see that I did pair a similar pair. I thought it was a sim the same, but it's not. A similar pair. The difference is the other pair was distressed. These have no distressing, and they are a little bit darker of a color. Now, a tip that I picked up from Sarah Ray Vargas is she has always suggested that when you go with darker denim to go ahead and size up for a lot of the things whether that be Shein or other brands so that's what I typically do and these again are in a 2XL and these are so comfortable and what I love and if you all are new here you're not going to know this but my area like literally this is the area that I'm trying to fit ignore the 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 situation we got going on here but I have thyroid issues and so I carry my weight right here I'm 43 years old so it's it's bound to happen you know so with that being said when you check my measurements and I tell you sizes and whatnot I am literally fitting to my stomach and my hips so that is why I went with a 2XL so sometimes if it fits here it may be baggier here but it is something we've learned to live with and I love the fact that these have a stretch. To go with these adorable jeans I got a couple different things so this is a shacket I believe it's called and this is more or no I'm sorry it's a 1XL I meant to do it so but whatever uh, so this is a cropped fitted jacket and I thought it would be really cute paired with these jeans because to me the fun part of the jeans are these three buttons in the wide waistband I just think for me I feel like it's really flattering because I've had such a hard time finding a thick waistband like this with the multiple buttons it's really frustrated me so I was really excited when I found Shein came out with them and they look really cute so I got this little zippy jacket jacket flannel whatever it's actually really soft 
Now the inside is not as soft as the outside. If you don't know, I do have a big like sensory thing. If something is itchy, I'm not gonna recommend it to you. Just letting you all know. I'm definitely very mindful of that. I love this fabric and the colors. It is very pumpkin spice and I did pick up a pair, a pair of boots. Now I was thinking it would be really cute with this outfit, but I'm not for sure with these jeans, but how cute are these? I mean, get a cute little denim skirt even. These are just so precious. So the nice thing about these shoes are the lace-ups. You don't have to do that every single time because we got a zipper. Zipper are our friends. I love these kind of heels where they're a bit thicker because I feel like I'm not having to worry about being too wobbly or anything like that. I mean, it's got a good height on it. I'm like 5'3 on a good day. Those good days don't happen too often. So I just rounded up to 5'3", okay? So anyways, I thought these were absolutely adorable, super, super cute, and giving me all the fall vibes. Okay, so this shacket, whatever you call it, I love it. It is in a 1XL. It fits perfect. I will tell y'all, if I go like this, which you're not really doing this too often, it does get a little tight back here. And you can see the sleeves come up a little bit. I don't feel like it's the end of the world, but if I were to do this over again, I'd probably, mm, I probably would have went with a 2XL because you're not always going to be wearing one of these like bando things. So for that reason, if I was wearing like sleeves or something, I feel like it would have tightened it up a little too much and scrunched everything because you see how it gets tight through here. So for me, I, I would recommend going up to a 2XL for that reason. Now, if you know you're only gonna wear a bando under it, you're gonna be fine. So, just something to keep in mind when you go with things like this. I do wish I had sized up, but I, it feels nice. I can zip it up. As far as these jeans go, I love them. They're in a 2XL, and you see what I'm talking about right through here? You've got that nice little accent where, which I don't know what's going on here. You see these little pocket thingies are, puckering a little bit that's kind of getting on my nerves um but eh, i don't think it's the end of the world but you see how it gives you more of that hourglass type of look i just i love it as far as the jeans go i do have a little bit of space back through here not the end of the world you do have real pockets which is nice it's not like a faux pocket situation uh, as far as they uh, where the length is they hit me right around the ankle and this is like a true skinny jean it has the stretch and everything so you don't have to you know worry as far as like it being stiff but they're definitely like feeling a little on the suction cup side. Not that I wouldn't wear them, just letting you all know. I did want to show you all the other pair that I have. This I believe was from the Sarah Ray Vargas collection. Now, these are in a 1XL. The ones I have on because they're darker are in a 2XL and I'm definitely glad that I went with that because if I had gone with a 1XL, this would have been too uncomfortable. I wouldn't have been able to like no, nah, it's a no for me. Now, these being a little bit lighter of a style, like color, and then it has a distressing. The 1XL fits perfect. It has like the three button thick waistband and everything, and it fits fine. So when Sarah said, you know, be mindful of darker denim, you need to size up. I'm definitely, definitely glad I listened to her because like I said, uh, 1XL in these would have been a no mayhem. So anyways, these are super cute. This is what I had on the last video if you are interested in them. I will have them linked and listed down below. If you all do see magic links down below, just know those are affiliate links. So I do earn a tiny little bit of a commission. Plus it does help to let brands know that I sent you their way. So if you do use any of my links, thank you all, I greatly appreciate it. Anyways, I'll have that linked down below. Okay, so this next item is in a 1XL and I'm honestly not for sure what it is. Maybe a dress? I don't remember picking this out. However, I feel like I'm gonna pull it off with the boots. So if you all caught my, I think it was a Shein runway video, I just was falling in love with like these 80s, 90s inspired long dresses. I just feel like they're just a total 
vibe. If you watch Pretty Woman, like that was one of my favorite movies from the 90s and I would constantly like rewatch it. Now I'll be honest with y'all, I wasn't allowed to watch like rated R movies. I'm pretty sure that was rated R. So I had to wait till it came to TV. <laughs> I mean like when all my friends were watching Dirty Dancing, going to the movies for it, I think that was PG-13. I wasn't allowed. I was, I was kind of a sheltered kid, but it's fine. Um, but uh, this reminded me of Pretty Woman TV version, clean version, and I just thought it was so cute. It does have a zipper in the back. I'm just going to pair it with these boots. Might, might be contrasty. I don't know. We're going to try because if you look, there's a little bit of that rust color in there. Just go with me. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. It's fine. Okay. So, I feel like y'all are going to be like, what the heck are you thinking? Just let me live my life. I absolutely love this dress. First of all, super lightweight and like soft and silky, but like probably polyester. There is no stretch. This is in a 1XL and it has like a drop waist. So I just went ahead and grabbed my Torrid belt that I pair with everything and I kind of put it a little higher up to kind of accentuate the smallest part of my torso and the boots just finish it off for me. I love this. I don't know if y'all watch, uh, what is her name? Hannah. She like lives in her van off and on and then also lives out in like Wisconsin in the woods or something. She always wears these kind of flowy dresses, typically in like white or neutral or whatever. But this gives me such a 90s, vibe it's ridiculous and then this little house on the prairie it's like pretty woman meets little house on the prairie and i love it it's so different it's definitely outside my comfort zone it's nothing that i think that i'd ever like walk in and think i need a dress that looks like this with this belt and these shoes but that's what i did and i really like it i think it is just so cute and i thought that the zipper went all the way down it does not it was actually like boom right here super easy i like the higher neck too and hold up i don't know i don't know maybe not this particular jacket this one is from zaffle it's a crop jacket maybe a little bit longer or darker of one but i mean you could make this your own i just i think it's fun this is a very vintage inspired so this is in a 2XL. I just love it. It is a flannel. This is like going in your man's closet kind of flannel. Like this is so old school. This is such a 90s vibe. And I was hoping that with the 2XL it would be long enough that I could pair it with the boots and then like throw a denim jacket over it. I don't know if that's going to happen. I mean that honestly, like some people get really bummed out that they're short don't we can make shirts dresses so we get a two for one you got to look at the positive side of things y'all you got to look at the positive side so i think this is super cute and even you know what i would love i would love to get a pair of combat boots with this uh she and has some i'm gonna be looking for some i'm gonna be looking for some because i think that would be so freaking adorable this is adorable i absolutely love it it's one of those flannels that like i was telling you all literally looks like you just pulled it out of your husband's closet i love it and i just kept on the jeans with it you could always like tie it up if you wanted i i feel like if i got a really cute pair of like i don't know biker pants i don't know i feel like it's long enough that you could make this a dress i definitely feel like you could make this a dress if you're short like me and I want to get combat boots because it just would give me that whole 90s grunge vibe. This is so comfortable. I love the flannel material. It's like a, I guess a true flannel. It's not like that itchy kind of flannel. It is just so cute. You can unbutton it a little bit more. And I have a cream bandeau that I would definitely pair with this. And I think it would be so flippin' cute. I just love it so much. It's a, it's a, it's a situation. I love it. Okay. So this one, again, I don't, I never remember like what I pick out. This is in a one XL. Typically that's what I roll with. Oh, okay. This is really 
70s like very retro does that not remind you of your grandma's like wallpaper or her plates from like uh i love it i'm living and again i'm gonna pair it with those brown boots i think this is gonna be so freaking cute i love the types of dresses that kind of cinch me in and like give me more of that hourglass type of look i like that faux uh wrap style this has no belt so of course you could just pair whatever belt you wanted with it if you need a belt with it i tend to not always or wear belts because i feel like i have such a short torso that it just kind of cuts me off even more but i am loving this i am so in love okay first off 1xl here's one little thing if i go like this ooh, it's a little mm, in that area because of the material however i love this dress is there pockets is there pockets oh no pockets i thought there was pockets with these boots this is a whole give me pumpkin spice latte vibes but i don't like pumpkin spice lattes like give me a caramel apple or some apple cider that's me i love this outfit again i want one of those like wide brim hats i think would look so adorable this is just so cute you don't need a belt whatsoever i love the fact that it's wrapped but look y'all look they have it like cinched right here so you don't have to worry about the girls like coming out and having a party it is just so cute i love it beltless i love right where it hits out of everything oh i loved a lot of stuff with this dress you all know how i feel about dresses you don't have to think you just throw it on paired with these boots i feel like these boots are like the statement piece of the outfit i absolutely flip and love this this is a win win if it comes in like a burgundy i would want it in a burgundy too you all know how i be when i find something i like i like it in every single color hence the jeans Alright friends, so that is part two of this Shein Curve haul. What do y'all think? I love this dress though. I absolutely love this dress. I just think it is so adorable. I love the flannels, the jeans, the boots. Everything was just great. Uh, if y'all are interested in picking up anything, don't forget code HOTMESS15. Not an affiliate code, but that will save you 15%. And I believe it's like everything like all things fifty dollars or all orders fifty dollars or more free shipping you get your rakuten and if you're signing up for rakuten you'll get that thirty dollar sign up bonus so actually you're only going to need to spend like twenty dollars just to get free shipping so everything that i showed you all today will be linked and listed down below if you are interested all the other items like sh the clear shoes jeans everything i will have listed down below for y'all anyways friends I'm going to hop off. I'm going to film my Savage X Fenty haul for you all. And then I'll be back with more Shein. Because, I mean, that's my love language. Affordable fashion that you can get a lot for your money. Why would you not? On top of that, you can get shoes. I got to get combat boots, though. I got to get their combat boots. Anyways, thank you to Shein for letting me pick out these outfits. I want to do, like, a, a picks. Hot Miss Mama picks like a closet. Wouldn't that be fun? We should make that happen. I'm down. All right, friends, stick around. Remember, we're all about body positivity here. No matter your size, no matter your number, everybody is welcome here. Definitely make sure to check out my Savage X Fenty haul because the way those items fit a curvy body is absolutely amazing. It has given me my groove back. Okay, I'll catch you all in the next video. Kisses from Kentucky. Mwah!